week, everybody. My name is RJ Garwitz. I'm the founder and CEO of WebTalk. Tonight, I'm actually going to talk to you about something, thank you very much, that is very important to me. And it's the future of AI and robotics. And I got the stool because you're going to have to sit down for this one. Right now, you'll see single function robots moving along and cleaning homes. They are, oh, excuse me, I'll jump right into the future of AI as it stands. Futuristics of AI and all the experts from Hanson Robotics, including um, Elon Musk and his companies, are predicting that artificial intelligence is going to surpass the knowledge, the collective knowledge, of the entire human race by 2025. Now, what this means is a new future, and that new future is all going to be based on robots and artificial intelligence doing jobs. This slide actually is supposed to show about the data that's 2.5 quintilobytes of data that's created every single day. The data that's being created every day is what's fueling AI. In the last year, over a half a trillion dollars between private and public sectors is invested into artificial intelligence and robotics. And the single purpose is because of money. Robots don't have an off switch. You can run them 24-7, 365, and you don't have to pay them vacation and sick days. They are going to replace many human jobs in the very new future. So it's already happening. Single function robots, they're using software that codes them for one particular function. Exist, and these robots are already replacing millions of jobs around the world. You can walk into Amazon plants right now and you'll find maybe a handful of employees where there used to be hundreds in every warehouse. Now they're moving to home services, maids, pool services, but this is just the beginning. These are one function robots, and they're moving beyond the simple tasks. Now they're in complex tasks. Now you can go to entire farms and you won't see a single human being. The entire process of farming is being completely automated by robots. Everything from mining crops, to filtering crops, to spraying crops, to picking weeds. All of it is being automated. The hospitality industry is changing. There are now, especially over in Asia already, robots that are replacing chefs. They're replacing waiters. They're replacing bartenders. They're replacing hostesses. Robots are replacing everything. Google is about to change the transportation industry in the next five years. Google owns Waymo. Waymo has self-driving trucks and cars already on the road in Arizona, and they're looking to expand in the next three years across the country. They are autonomous, on-demand, self-driving trucks and cars. For 100 bucks, you'll no longer need insurance, a car payment, or gas. You'll be able to call a car on demand. Military has been doing it for decades. Our US military spends 10 times more than the next nine countries behind. Why? Because of AI and robotics. Their entire government's being automated. White collar is already being hit too. Right now you can have Google Assistant now replaces your assistant. They'll make phone calls for you, schedule everything. You've got tons of AI and robotics already in first generation, but this is just the beginning. All the money that's being poured in the last three years, trillions of dollars globally, hasn't even had an effect yet. This is all research and development money. In the next six years, the second generation of robotics is already going to be among us. And Hansen in Hong Kong, funded by the Chinese government, is already here. Hansen Robotics has developed not one, but two humanoid robots that they're predicting in the next three years will be smarter than the collective intelligence of the entire human beings. Take this knowledge, take what they've coded in somebody's robot, and then put them into the functions of the Honda Osmo robot that can do everything a human can do, but hasn't had the intelligence to do it yet. These robots are gonna be coded to build homes, to do every single manual labor job, to do every single administrative job, and it's gonna look like this. The clock is ticking. They are literally, this is not science fiction, this is happening within the next decade. Once artificial intelligence get plugged into multifunctional robots, jobs by the millions, tens of millions, and eventually hundreds of millions are gonna be gone. And what's gonna replace them? Robots are eventually gonna replace themselves. They're gonna fix themselves. They're gonna be on their own replacement line. 
So then what? You have Elon Musk and Mark Zuckerberg, Stephen Hawking, all claiming for a universal income because people are going to lose their jobs. Right now it's time to act. We need regulation. If we don't regulate it, we don't teach our children in school from fifth grade and on how to code and how to develop and how to be an acting part of this, and who knows what's going to happen. So today is the wake-up call for what's about to happen. Thank you very much.